Man, what an absolute crazy couple of days. We got Microsoft purchasing Activision for about $70 billion. So now Microsoft, AKA Xbox, now owns Call of Duty, Overwatch, and a bunch of other titles under Activision. Obviously, I can tell you, rest in peace to PlayStation exclusives, that's for sure. But the question that a lot of people have been asking is, is there any chance they're going to make Call of Duty an Xbox exclusive? If they wanted to, they would have to jump through a lot of legal barriers because of their current contract. But no, they're not going to be doing that. Phil Spencer came out. He is the head of Xbox. Came out with a tweet right here. I'll throw it up. He says, had good calls this week with leaders of Sony. I confirmed our intent to honor all existing agreements upon acquisition of Activision, Blizzard, and our desire to keep Call of Duty on PlayStation. Sony is an important part of our industry and we value our relationship. So there you have it. Anybody who thought that it could potentially be an Xbox ex exclusive, there you go. It's not happening. But you already know when it comes to exclusives, Call of Duty, if you're, if you're a console player, that's probably where I would make the move to is xbox because we don't exactly know what the game is going to be like now that it's in the hands of microsoft will the updates go out first for people on xbox we all know they'll get the exclusives i know if i was a console player i would just feel better if you're able to find one and make that switch a lot of people are really happy with how halo came out and call of duty is in such a bad shape at the moment i know the numbers might be saying something different but when it comes to the war zone and the multiplayer experience, which has completely just gone downhill in the last, you know, six years. I can't wait to see the changes that they make. Rather, they, they mess around with the skill-based matchmaking. Maybe they try to return Call of Duty back to its core. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down below about Microsoft buying Activision. What do you think that means for the future of Call of Duty? Hope you guys liked this video. If you did, make sure you hit that sub button for me and I'll catch you guys later.